One, two, three, one, two, and. Was age 65 at the old wall CR. She was commissioned to haul the black tar. Built the Northumbria there on the bar. Roll Northumbria, roll. For when the Egyptians, they closed the Red Sea. That was Roll Northumbria by the Dreadnoughts, and we played it straight from the charts of the Morristown Uke Jam. So take the link in the video description, download the free ukulele song sheet, grab your own ukulele, and you can play right along with this video. And if you'll be uh, anywhere near Morristown, New Jersey, come out and play with us. In just a moment, I'll do a basic tutorial covering everything we just played. At the very end, I'll do a slow motion close-up play along that you might find helpful. But right now, if you like the video, please like the video with a thumbs up. If you want lots more, subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you want over a thousand more free downloadable ukulele song sheets, each one with a link to its own free video tutorial and play along just like this one, then check out our Dropbox and then come play with us. Okay, right hand. I'm just gonna play a C chord here and show y'all what you need to do for uh, this song with the right hand. Actually, I'm going to play a C5 because it sounds more like this song. That's it. It's a 3 4 song, as in 1 2 3, 1 2 3, 1 2 3. The emphasis is on the first of the three. So you go down, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, down, down. The entire song. That's it. I don't think there are any exceptions in the song. That's it for the right hand. This is a song you could play. Uh, just as well as me, even if you only have one finger on your right hand. So, cool. Chords, you need kind of most of your fingers to be able to play this one. I'm going to sort of apologize. It's a sort of apology, not apology. I'm sorry I couldn't make an easier version of this song. I mean, I could have, 
with just a G instead of a G5, C instead of a C5, D instead of a D5, it would have been a lot easier. Wouldn't have sounded right. I would have had to change the melody. I tried. I tried playing it that way, and I'm like, ah, oh, that's not that's not right. It just it needs to be the uh, it needs to be the fifth. So I apologize for that, but I'll show you that it might not be as hard as you think, even if you're a beginner. Here we go. G5, first off, I'm playing it this way. Here will be a standard G, right? But I'm using my middle finger here, my pinky up here. And now it sounds more like I'm playing an accordion, right? Like they did, or uh, like bab pipes. It, Cause it, it only has two notes in it, that fifth. It doesn't have the, the, uh, what is that? That's a D. It doesn't have the, the third note that makes it sound, uh, I don't know, makes it sound fuller, makes it ring truer. Um, this is more like a drone sound. So that's how I shape my G5. And while that's not such an easy chord, the rest of the song is actually not hard. Actually, I'll do it this way. You could do it either that way or this way. I'm not going from a G, though, so I'm going to use my middle finger, my strong finger. From the G5... The C5, I just lay it down. I just lay down my middle finger, and then do it again. Drop it back up, right? I'm just going back up, back and forth. And that's three quarters of the verse right there. The D5, I move both my, my index finger and my pinky over, so they're each covering two strings, right? The first and second from the floor, the third and fourth from the floor. And then I'm going to put my middle finger there for that D7 and back to the G5. See, so that's, again, I start with the G5. Roll Northumbria, roll. Or roll Northumbria, roll. Me boys, roll Northumbria, roll. That's it for the verses. That's it, that's it. That's all there is for the verses. The chorus is a little trickier. But it's fine. It goes, it goes uh, kind of more mainstream. That is to say, it lays off the fifths for the most part, except the very end when you're going back into the verse. So it's, and it's one for the hot sun above. So I, I'm going again. I'm starting with a G fifth. So I take my middle finger. I lay it across three strings. I nearly bar the third fret, right? Three strings. That's my C minor. One for the hot sun above. Now I just have to pick them all up. Well, actually... You, if you want to think of it this way, your middle finger kind of arches up and just covers one, you know, the third string from the floor in that B flat. But, or you can just pick them all up. Anyway, to that B flat. And then your middle finger is once again kind of the anchor point. Everything else picks up and twists around around it for that D. Two for the Empire Wheeler. And then... Going to the G minor, your ring finger is going to slide up one fret. Your middle finger stays right there. That's your G minor. And now, focus on the middle finger again. You're just going to slide it up one fret for that D fret. A e flat. That's all it is. Right ahead of the G minor. Just slide it up one fret, and that's an E flat. Three for the fire that. And back to that B flat. Comes down below. And now, twist around to the D. Roll on. Now, I like the way it sounded. You know, to, to roll on Northumbria. So that's why I put in that second form of a D. But you can, you can stick on that D. That's the only place where you could really simplify it if you wanted. But So roll. Now I lay my index finger flat to, to bar the second fret and drop a pinky for that second position D. Northumbria, and we're back to the stylings of the verse. Roll Northumbria, roll. And that's it. Okay, now I'm going to do a slow motion close up play along, but the verses are all exactly the same, so I think what I'll do is I'll play the intro, the first two verses, and then the chorus. Right? The rest of the song, like I said, is, is a repetition of that. So. Starting with the intro, slow motion, and you don't need to see my right hand because you know what it's doing. Very consistent. Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, and. Egyptian 
that's it. See you Wednesday. Bye.